Hi friends, welcome back. We have a more double trouble maker in trouble. We're on ch at chapter nine. The mega drama is about to start. Let's see what happens next in this chapter. Let's go. Brody and I were back together. His dad was in jail and everything was perfect. Then I went and tempted fate by trying to become friends with Elias again. But Elias is pregnant. And Brody is the father. Brody is 100% the father of Elias' baby? That's what the test said. Well, I feel awful for Elias, but that Brody, I can't say I'm surprised. I thought he turned over a new leaf, especially since he helped hit, hit, he helped us put his dad behind bus bars. I can't read that sentence. I did too. Looks like we're all, we were all wrong. I'm tired, guys. I'm sorry. Mom is crying over Brody? That doesn't make sense. I'm sorry, honey. I know this is a rough time all around. I've been talking with lawyers all morning. Your father might be getting out of jail. Really? Dad might be coming home? We don't know yet, but Jake Kaysen is going to jail and has thrown everything up in the air. That is, would be so awesome. He could move back home with, and we could... I don't know how I, Jeff and JJ would feel about that. Oh gosh, I didn't even think about that. If Dad comes home, what's it's go gonna happen to them? Are you still going to get married? Yes, no, I don't know, sweetie. Sweetie, there's a lot uh, to deal with right now. Well, do you still do you love Jeff or do you love Dad? Honey, love and life are very complicated. I'm sure you're learning that f firsthand. Once this settles, I'll be able to make some choices. But until then, Jeff and JJ should be able to make choices too. But if you don't love Jeff. You have to tell him. It's not fair to him. Honey, just because someone isn't with you every day, that it doesn't mean you can't turn off the part of you that loves them. Just like Brody. I know, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to shout. It's okay. I have to get going. Can you keep an eye on Carrie today? Sure. Thanks, honey. Hey, Care Bear. Have fun, girls. Brody looks funny. What does that mean? He's outside and he's all twitchy. It's silly. Brody's outside. Brody's fine. He's probably just want a cigarette or something. Cigarettes are yucky. Yes, they are, kiddo. What do you want to do today? I want to play mommy and daddy like Elias and Brody. What? No. We're not doing that. Who told you about that? Let, let's get you some juice or something. What the heck, Harry? What the heck? I thought we were, we, we were going to work on your bike today. I can't concentrate on everything, anything. I'm, I've am i just been, like, staying here trying to make sense of everything. Want to smoke up? Nah, if I'm going to be around a kid, I don't want to smell like six or blunts or whatever. Look at you, man. Taking responsibility, cleaning up your act. Sure. Everything explains why you're fidgety as shit. Way to be a friend, Zach. I'm serious. I'm proud of the way you're stepping up, man. It's cool. I guess. Sucks that your family's money is frozen while your dad's in jail. Yeah. And have you talked to Carolyn? Are you guys even together now? Well, we're... It's complicated, but I can't ask her to take this on. She's tough, I'm sure. No, dude. My dad made me break her heart for the... For the family. I put her through it too much. The last thing I'm going to do is ask to be a stepmom at 17. Okay, it sucks, but it's probably for the best. Let's go working on this bike. I'm going to sell it. It'll be, it's got to be tricked out. Cool. I picked up the wrong week to quit smoking. And I'm back to where I started, in sweats, in my room, and heartbroken because of Brody Kaysen. Like always. Okay, girly, let's get going. We're running late. For what? Lola is throwing Elias a baby shower. Right, because that is where I wanted to be. You're the one who wanted to make up with her. That was before my boyfriend was her baby daddy. Brody is still your boyfriend? We're taking a break while they figure this stuff out. 
Okay, so like an 18 year break? You suck. This happened while you weren't even together, and Elias is really freaked out right now. We should try to be there for her. You're right, I hate it, but you're, but you're right. Now come on, it's going to be awkward. Aren't you supposed to say it's going to be fun? Nope, not in this case. What are you going to wear? I'm going, let me see, you're dressing up? Of course, I'm not going to be a scrub all day. If I'm a scorned woman, I'm going to be looking good. Good looking school women. Ooh, that's up. Oh my god, twenty five dollars. What's the point? What do you mean? Every time I try, something bad happens. So I'm just gonna keep it simple. Are you sure? As sure as I can be. Ah, uh, yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, that's just who I am now. Try not to, you know, go crazy on the snacks or anything. What are you talking about? It's just that you're in your sweats again, which means you have a tendency to do. Overdo it in the snack department. No, I don't. I wish I was I was with you after Brody dumped you the first time. I saw how much ice cream you went through. That was different. I was heartbroken. And now you're... Darn it. I try. Keyword. Try. <laughs> it, yeah. And then my character got fat. <laughs> Fatter, but none of the models in this episode game have... Like... A little bit different shapes, except the pregnancy one. How is everyone doing? H have enough to drink, eat, don't fill up too much. We'll be playing games in j just a minute. Hey, handsome. Where's Brody? On his way. Where's the mama to be? She's resting. Have fun, okay? Sure. Hey, Carolyn. I'm sorry about all this. It's okay. Seriously. Are you sure? You look like you've been up all night crying. No, I don't. Don't be mad. That's just one man's opinion. Did we miss anything? Nah, Lola is doing the rounds. Ellis is resting and Brody is on his way here. I'm going to grab something to, to drink. I think Sebastian is here too. Brody is not here? Not yet, but you should see this guy. You won't even recognize him. Brody? Yeah, he's like cleaning up his act. He started doing his homework, and and he stopped smoking. Brody Kaysen? <laughs> I know. Who would have thought all it would take off for Brody to straighten up if he, for him to have something important in his life? Right, because I wasn't important enough to, for him. For him, that's uh, that's good for him. That stupid, beautiful jerk. Oh, Kara, you came, and your dress is like you're about to take an actual shower. How classy! I was telling Carol about how Brody's been manning up. Isn't it great? He's going to be a, such a great father and a husband. Husband? I'm, I'm just assuming he'd be marrying Ellis. You're not still together, are you? I uh, We'll take it some time while he figures out what's next. That's so cute of you to think that. Oh my god, I want to slap her. JJ? Hey, look. JJ, look how good you look. Lola invited me. Of course I invited you. I can go if it's too weird. Weird? What would it be weird? The only person in this this could possibly be weird for it is Caroline. Isn't it right? Isn't it Caroline? Are you going to make a scene? Okay, I can't read anymore. No, of course not. But I really want to slap her. Good. I'm going to go see where Sprody is. No, no, no. Not just slap her. Can I just stab, stab her? Are you, like, friends with Lola now? We've been over this, okay? She's nice to me. Are you guys dating? Is that what it is? No, but I wouldn't hate that. Seriously? You know, there's nothing going on between us, right? We're not a couple. I know, but... Look, bro between Brody, Ellis, the baby, your parents, all that, you got enough to deal with. I don't need to be part of it. JJ, it's okay. I'm not mad. I'm just realistic. Why is every guy in my life abandoning me? Okay, deep breaths. Let's do this. Hey, Elle. Caroline, you're here. I'm so happy you're here. I wouldn't miss it. She's a true friend, isn't she, Elias? Totally. And just think, Carolyn and I are going to look so cute as bridesmaids when you and Brody get married. Married? Wait, are you getting married? No! You don't want your kid to be a bastard, do you? No, but 
then you and Brody have to get married. What kind of tradition is that? I mean, please tell me. Yeah. I mean, God, please. No, we don't. Brody is with Caroline. I thought you got were on a break until Ellis and Brody figured it out. And I even assumed that part of figuring it out was all that money. What money? Brody's money. Stop it, Lola. She doesn't know. Brody didn't tell you. Lola, please. What is going on? Don't listen to her, Carol. Let's have some punch. I love punch. Brody's trust fund is frozen by the state until he's 30. So? But he can have it if he gets married. Wait, what? Lola! At least you knew about this. Brody and I have been talking. It's the only way they can pay for the baby. They have to. I'm okay. I'm gonna go snap at Lola. Ellis, I can tell the fa the in the face of Elias that that she didn't want to be part of this. Lola, stop it! Stop it! Stop what? They have to. No, they don't. Not if they want. Don't want to. There's always a choice. We're going to figure out the best way to take care of this baby, but we don't have to do anything like get married. Right. Fine, but don't be. Don't do the obvious thing that will ensure your child is taken care of. There's more choices than that. You're so selfish, Caroline. Me? Yeah, all you care about is yourself. Otherwise, you'd want Ellis to marry Brody. That doesn't make any sense. What else are you going to do, Elle? Your parents said they wouldn't help. You're all alone. It will it'll be tough, but... And you obviously like Brody enough to have the, a baby with him. That's, there's a lot to think about. What's going... What's to think about? Lola, stop it. No, you're standing in the way of their happiness. Please, you're both upsetting me. You should be upset. She's trying to steer Brody away from you. What kind of friend are you? Me? We're already together. Ellis is the one who's stealing him. No, I'm not. Yes, you're the one who wants to marry him. It's not like that. It's exactly like that. Why can't you live your own life? My own life? You're the one who can't breathe without Brody's permission. You don't know what you're talking about. No, you don't. And what You don't know what you're talking about. I was stupid to think we could ever be friends again. I, I hope being with Brody makes you as miserable as it made me. How dare you? Get, get out of my house. Like I want to be any... Like I want to be here anyway. You suck, Lola. You both do. What the hell is going on? You're being played for for your money. Did you know that? Ellis has nothing to do with my family's money, okay? Yeah, right. You're too stupid to see what she did. You can't talk to her or me like that. None of this is Ellis' fault. Whatever. Don't cry. Don't cry. Don't cry. Are you okay? I need to lay down. Your girlfriend is awful. Shut up, Lola. I just want to stab her. I burst out the door and soon burst into tears. How could Brody do this to me? There's no way we can be together now. And I forgot I came here with Amy and I'm stuck. Hey, I'm sorry, okay? I shouldn't have yelled. Why didn't you tell me? I didn't want you to freak out. Obviously, that was a mistake. You're going to marry her, aren't you? I don't know. I can't do this. I can't be a part of this. I know it's complicated, but we agreed to that once Ellis and I figured everything out, we make it work. So what? I'll wait for you to raise your kid together, and then maybe you'll date me? Where is this attitude coming from? This is hard for me, too. Brody, you're 70. You can't raise a kid unless you have money, and you don't get money unless you're married. There's no other way. We can figure something out, and you quit smoking for her. So, I wore a wire and incriminated my own dad for you. You said it wasn't for me. Whatever. Tell her wait to quit smoking. I'm I'm in the way. It's that simple. Nothing is simple. No, it, it is. You should be with your mother of your child. You should get married so you can take care of them. It's the only thing that makes sense. I'll figure something out. No, I'm doing it for you. I'll fig I said I'll figure something out. What done, Brody? For good. Caroline. No. It's over. Go be with Elias. Oh, uh, now Brody breaks down for the first time. Oh, that's it. Okay. Thanks for watching. Let's catch you next time on more Double Trouble, where we, ha we have five more chapters left. So anyways, I'll uh, catch you next time. Bye.